Hello all and welcome. My name is George Zafirakis from Trust Me on Greek. I'm here today uh, doing a series of videos across places that we, we've been to, we enjoy going with my wife and wanted just to share with you some of those uh, venues, restaurants, bars, cocktail bars, beaches, anything that we've seen and we thought, do you know what, people should definitely come here. I uh, wanted to uh, create some video footage and obviously show it to you. If you're watching that anywhere in the world, uh, be sure to come and check these places out. We are today at Catellos. Uh, this is a lovely little village in uh, nearby um, uh, Scala area. If you're traveling down that area in Kefalonia, um, you should definitely come down and check it out. It's a small little beach, got a series of restaurants, quite little location, brilliant for families. And obviously safe, safe for everyone to uh, hang around, have some fun. And uh, the food and the people are really, really lovely. So, um, as you can see the backdrop behind me, this is the, the beach. Um, obviously some lounges, most of the lounges around the area will provide uh, free lounges if you're a customer at the venue. Uh, so let's, let's take you through and show you what it looks like up close.
Hey guys, one other little quick venue stop. Uh, if you are around the area in Catellos, you should definitely check out this place called Waves. Um, as you're coming down towards Catellos, turn left. You can park your cars, as you can see behind me here. Uh, you can see with uh, various obviously other tourists have enjoyed the parking, which is free. Um, and then you can walk yourself into this lovely little quiet zone and grab a drink and just enjoy the views, as you can see behind me. So if you are here, check out a place called Waves. Won't regret it. So here we are, we're in Catellos Beach. Uh, we are, it is the 11th of June. It's now five o'clock, so it's really nice and quiet around here. Everyone's relaxing, catching in the last race of the day before they get ready for a nice meal. The area, it's got a series of restaurants, uh, little cocktail bars, um, and obviously it's a perfect location if you're looking for some peace and quiet, just to come and relax. Um, perfect for families, perfect for you to come and just relax, have a couple of drinks in the sunshine, uh, enjoy the sun rays and just get some chill time. Now this is one of the per our favourite spots with my wife. We come here every, every year, uh, we stay for a couple of days and we enjoy the food. Obviously the people are very, very friendly and the food is exceptional. A couple of places definitely worth checking out is Nemesis, Oburo, um, Jerry's Restaurant, one of the, the few that I've uh, actually tried out myself and would highly recommend. But as you can see behind me, the backdrop, it is a beautiful spot. There's uh, free sound lounges uh, for, uh, for customers on venues um, and everyone, as I said, is super friendly here. So if you're around the area, if you're in Catalonia and you want to venture down to visit Scala or Catellos, highly recommend it. And if you are looking to stay somewhere, Catellos is a perfect spot with access to uh, loads of other little areas like Scala, where you have access to more restaurants and some good cocktail bars and beaches. That's it for me for now, and uh, we'll catch you soon on the other side. Hi everyone, I'm at Razakli village, uh, Tataruga uh, venue uh, in Kaminia Beach, just off Scala, uh, near Catellos as well. So if you are in the area, definitely worth a visit. It's got a little bit of wind uh, today. Uh, hopefully that will, uh, will uh, disappear over the next couple of days, but still a lovely venue spot if you want to have a drink, something to eat or just chill out. The, the people here are really friendly and uh, offer good quality uh, drinks and food so um, let's show you quick around and then I'll give you another video soon when the weather is a little bit nicer
we're at uh, the Tataruga Beach Bar and the owners and the staff in a minute. Uh, but what we do have here, what you can do is a lot of things. Not only enjoy the view that you have behind me that you can see here, but you can also enjoy a swim at the Turtle Beach. Uh, for those turtle enthusiasts, you have the luxury and the opportunity to kind of see turtles being hatched here at the beach. It's quite amazing. So if you do come here, just be very wary of that so you don't step on any turtle nests. They try to uh, uh, spot them out so you can avoid them. Um, you can explore the traditional kiln museum. Obviously, they've got really tasteful uh, seasonal uh, cuisine and cocktails. Um, and of course, they've got a little pop-up store over there which was handcrafted materials. We're gonna talk to one of the guest guys in a minute. Um, we'll do a quick intro. Constantinos. <laughs> playing uh, last year yeah together you were singing uh, Hazard Rising Sun yes I did I was a drummer my man <laughs> I like your drumming okay you sing again y yes if, uh, if it's available I'll do it, it. Is. Okay, so my name is uh, George Zafirakis from Trust Me I'm Greek. We are here at Tataruga Beach Bar. Phenomenal, really great little venue. Uh, we're talking to Konstantinos, uh, one of the team members here. So Konstantinos, well, not only team members at the venue, but also a very good drummer. Uh, so Konstantinos, tell us a few things of what people can expect coming here, things that they can do. Uh, from your perspective, things that you offer at the venue? Okay, first of all, uh, the beach here is in Natura, okay? So the turtles come here, lay their eggs. So many times uh, last year, people uh, were, uh, were, uh, were able to witness uh, the small turtles going out from the, from the sea, from the sun, sorry. And, amazing. And going for the journey into the sea. Yeah, it's really a, cool. It's very amazing. Love it. Of course, it's the the beach here is amazing you can swim here the waters are very shallow it's perfect for uh, small children yeah also for couples it's uh, very romantic very nice and now let's go to the, the venue the venue as you can see it's a boho style bohemian oh, it's all natural yes yeah. and and in terms of times that you're open are you open in the morning we open and nine o'clock in the morning okay and we go like till uh, 10 11 it depends yeah and I noticed you've got uh, lounges, sun lounges at the bottom of the yeah, beach for people lounges to use. It's 10 euros uh, per set. Yeah. And uh, of course there is a guy down there that you can order something to eat or drink and okay. we deliver from, from here down there. Brilliant. So for about 10 euros you can sit by the beach, you can use the venue, you can have cocktails, a bit of food, some burgers. Exactly. Yes. And of course you can get served by this fantastic gentleman here and the rest of the team. I can honestly say they're very friendly here, really, really good. Uh, you. If you can make it down here, just off Scala Catellos, uh, very close. If you've got a car, you can drive, you can walk it even. Um, if you, a lot of natural sort of walk paths around the area. So come down and visit it. You will not regret it. Try one of the cocktails. Spot on, very beautiful stuff. Okay, we are here now at the at the little store and we're talking to Leon Dia. Nice Leon. to meet you. Hi Leon Dia, really nice to meet you. So this is all uh, natural produce, little items that you have here. They're all handmade from Sorry. our they're all handmade from ourselves uh, from our friend Silvia. They're all Italian fabrics. Very and nice. We have also some bags. They're also handmade, and we're gonna have some jewelry from our friend Stella. Fantastic. Well, this is one of the things that you can actually come and see here. Not only uh, meet wonderful Leondia and also see the rest of the staff and buy some really nice natural produced products, uh, but the vibe here is absolutely brilliant. So if you look around, you got your natural museum area. And so we keep the tradition of our Kiel Museum. You can see there the tradition of the kilns. Here was my grand, uh, the grand uh, papa, grand, uh, my dad. Grandfather, yeah. Grandfather, yes. Oh, very and good. With the earthquake, all destroyed, and he died here. Wow. So, so yes, we, we keep that. So you're maintaining the heritage and the history of that, and mm -hmm. just, uh, you know, the memories are... Exactly. We also serve food on a kiln. Yes. Good. Um, we're waiting for you. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. Well, that is a quick 
quick chat with uh, Leondia. Thank you very much. You're and uh, more to come for the rest of the holiday. Uh, we are here ourselves on holiday. This is not just a sponsored trip or anything like that. But what we do enjoy is the things that we, we wanted to share, the things that we enjoy, the places that we like to go to. Um, and uh, this is definitely one of them. So come and check it out. So we are back. Uh, we had a couple of um, really cool tips about what you can experience outside of the venue on the beach. But what we didn't talk about just yet is things that we can actually experience as a customer here at Tataruga Beach Bar uh, from the food, uh, cocktail perspective and general vibe. So back with Costandinos. Uh, so if you don't mind, please, Master Chef, uh, tell us <laughs> what sort of things we can uh, we can kind of experience here as a customer from food and all that sort of stuff. Things that people maybe should try out if they haven't tried it already. First of all, we have top quality meat products yeah, and top quality uh, cocktails. It's everything is, it might be a small, you know, um, the variety is not like big, yeah, but it's small and 100% good and select. Good, yes, excellent. Uh, I'm gonna tell you about the meat because we bring meat from uh, Ioannina. It's a city. It's a local farm there that yeah. has a biological breeding, so it brings the best quality uh, burger and uh, T-bone steak and tagliata wow. chimichurri that you're ever gonna taste. Yeah. It's amazing. We have also sea bream fresh sea bream yeah and we have mexican food like finger food like mexican quesadillas we have tacos uh, if you never tasted yuca potatoes is something amazing unique and these are what the potatoes from peru they're potatoes from peru exactly wow, yeah. we boil them first and then we fry them so they become a little bit crunchy on the outside very amazing, good amazing potatoes. very good my mouth is watering <laughs> so, so before you go just yeah. the things about uh, if people don't eat meat or any vegan dishes and yeah of like course that. we have vegan uh, we have vegan burger we have vegan quesadillas we have vegan gyros which is amazing with a variety of mushrooms wow Very so nice. you cater for any type of cuisine for any type of taste really. yes exactly that's yeah. amazing and to promise we're right behind you can see the cocktail bar behind us yeah uh, the tall guy there is. I've, I've had a good selection of the cocktails already uh, we won't go through a list of all of them, but I think you're right. You know, you've got five cocktails that are very, very Great. good. Uh, My recommendation, because I like sweet tastes, is uh, elderflower. Elderflower. Yeah. Let's do that. If you like sweet. Good. That's me. And the venue, the view is amazing as well. So yeah, in terms you can of, see the if we'll, we'll do a quick the island of Zaki, because you can see it. But now the weather conditions are not so good. But you can see the night. You can see the light. Yeah, today it's a little bit cloudy, which is okay. But the other thing is, I, I've been here before, and you've had really cool live music as well. Yeah, yeah, we do. We do some live gigs. Uh, we're gonna have probably one every week from July. Me and my friends, we're gonna be in the, in the so first not live. Not only a cool chef, but Blues. you also play the music as yeah, well. Yeah, I play Good. the music also, and you have amazing vocals. <laughs> I know. Very kind. I'm sure everybody knows that. But following you. <laughs> no worries, no worries. Well, look, this is about the venue. So thank you very much again, Costa. Thank you very much. Thank you. An absolute pleasure. I really appreciate it. Guys, definitely come and check it out. We said this already. Really nice people. Get to say hi to Costa Dinos and the wider team. And uh, you. enjoy your holiday if you come here. So that's it over now. Trust me on Greek. See you soon. <laughs>welcome back to trust me in greek a uh, quick snapshot of a lovely venue that we found in uh, just after scala uh, and after kaminia um, just on kaminia beach actually a bit further down tucked into the corner is called animos lovely beach and also a really cool restaurant that you can see here uh, we'll take some more snapshots in a bit